What is the magnitude of the resultant of two vectors A and B if A equals 24 units east and B equals 15 units south? First, we're going to draw out our vectors. So vector A, A, I'm going to use the arrow notation and note that A is a vector. It's equal to 24 units. And then our vector B is 15 units to the south. So this is north, this is east, this is west, and this is south. So first one, A in red is directed to the east, and vector B, which is in green, is directed to the south. If we now add these two using the tail to tip method, so A plus B is equal to vector C, we would have A, which is 24 units, plus vector B, which is 15 units to the south, would result in a vector C as shown down here. Now once again, we would apply the Pythagorean theorem to solve for the magnitude of C. So C squared is equal to A squared plus B squared, we remember. So C is equal to the square root of A squared plus B squared. Because remember from triangle, we're trying to solve for the length of the hypotenuse. It's simply A squared plus B squared is equal to C squared. Take the square root of both sides, we wind up with this form. Now, if we apply this form to this triangle here, we would have C is equal to a square root of A squared plus B squared. Now, if we plug in the values for A and B, we would have that C is equal to square root of 24 units squared plus 15 units squared, which would give us, we do 24 units squared, that would give us 576 units squared. And 15 units squared will give you 225 units squared. Now, if we add those two values together, C is equal to the square root 801 units squared. And then, if we take the square root of that, we would find that the resultant magnitude of C is roughly 28.3 units. So the magnitude of the resultant C shown here in blue is 28.3 units.